At Trinity, everyone has a story. A simple letter discussing opening a new high school, written by Monsignor Alfred Steinhauser, soon became a storied history beginning when 106 freshmen walked onto a new campus on September 8, 1953. Trinity is built upon stories. Without letters from Monsignor Steinhauser, approval to be called Shamrocks from Evelyn Fultz, or faith-filled lessons from Father Zettel, we wouldn't be where we are. But it's not just the faculty who helped form the story of this high school. It's the students. Students with imaginative visions, unique narratives, and pictures to paint. One, two, one, go! Live the fourth, Trinity, forever. Student athletes who go to battle on this very field. He'll go in for the touchdown. Trinity claims the lacrosse championship. Write their own stories each and every time they lace up their cleats or put on the green uniform. Touchdown, Trinity. The Trinity boys basketball team to win the state championship. Trinity baseball first state championship. Now. We have a major outlet to tell our stories of classes, extracurriculars, faith, and sports, graphically, visually, and vocally, through this brand new, highly advanced video board. The people are what make Trinity energized, and Trinity is what brings our own stories to life. Rob drops straight back, breaks the tackle, cuts back across the red again, sees the wide receiver over the end zone, touchdown! Trinity. He's looking for Spencer in the end zone, it's intercepted! Unbelievable! Good morning, Trinity. Hi, members of Trinity, how you doing? The Rocks. Rondell Moore. He was your game MVP. Has some room. He is a magician! Rocks by a million! Yeah, Good luck on your finals next week, Trinity. 1988 State 4A champion, the Trinity the Shamrocks to win the program's 27th state title. But remember, no matter how far you may go, know that you always have a home at Trinity. Time moves quickly. Freshman, sophomore, junior, and senior year. Four years to tell a story. What will your Trinity story be?